Well, a lot, a lot of stuff go on in Chicago, but it's just the environment we in, and you know, our, you know, our people, you know, they, they, they really love us. I just say it like that. They really love us, but and they hope for the best for us. But you know, it's just hard times right now, you know. And, and I, like my people, they can't take care of me. Like my mom, she been on drugs like 20 years now. And that, you know, that messed up, gave her an angry rhythm in her head, you know what I'm saying? She had strokes back to back, you know what I'm saying? And she messed up her eye vision too. So, I, you know what I'm saying? I, I thought I'd do that, you know, my little sister's them in the house too, you know what I'm saying? No food in the house, none of that. So, I, you know, I got to go out here and get some money. But I did the right thing, though. I ain't going to sell no drugs, you know what I'm saying? Go rob people and none of that. I went to go beat me some buckets. That's what I went to go do. I went to go beat me some buckets. I learned how to, you know what I'm saying, contribute to my money, put my money up, buy my little sister and stuff like that. And that's why, you know what I'm saying, I think a lot of stuff come come to me, good blasters and, you know what I'm saying, a lot of stuff. I think, like some angel be watching, you know, I think it'd be my grandma or my granddaddy, cause them the main people who was in, you know what I'm saying, that, that made history in our family. Like, I think, like, they, like they guided me, like, they taking me to the, to the right path, like. A lot of stuff like it's real out here, but I, I know it's real out here. That's why you know I want to go to college. You know what I'm saying? And get what I need to get for myself. You know, but I ain't saying like I ain't waiting on nobody else and none of that. But you know, I just gotta do what I gotta do first. That's all I want. My little sisters, all right. That's all. I swear, that's all I want, man. It's yeah. How old is your sister? 15 to 16. Mm -hmm. And my mama, she she 50 now. She just turned 50 on um, December 4th. You know, you know. She ain't even know my birthday, you know what she feel? She ain't even know my birthday no more because she lost so much memory in her head. She ain't even know my birthday, bro. That's how real it was. But I just, you know, I pray for her every night, you know, I pray for myself too. I pray for myself, you know, I pray to the rapper, you know what I'm saying? Make sure everything right for me in the future. I had it, that's all. I just don't want to die at no young age or, you know what I'm saying, go to jail for the rest of my life. That's all. That's the only thing I don't want to do. That's mm -hmm. all. I go to church sometime. I don't go every Sunday. I ain't, you know, I ain't gonna lie to you. I don't go every Sunday. Mm -hmm. I go sometime, though. When I when I know, you feel me, time me to go. When I see little signs coming my way and stuff like that, I go, you feel me, out of my business, bro. But I just, I can say, yes, yeah, you know what I'm saying? These right here, it can take you, it can take you somewhere. I went to the Kentucky Derby, Cincinnati. Uh, yeah, the Cincinnati Reds game. Go to the Cubs game every day when the Cubs are um, out here. Sox game, Bulls game, and the Bears game. So, hopefully, you know what I'm saying, I can make the best out of it. I can go somewhere. That's all. Awesome. Yeah, I'm 19. My birthday is September 26th. I was born 1992. My name is Timothy Anderson. That's my little brother right here. That's my cousin. You know, pretty much me and him, we grew up feeling the same pain, struggle. Like, my mom, she was on drugs heavy, too, but now she cleaned herself up. Thank God. I'm the greatest God. Now she live across the street from me now. I stay with my grandparents, and my father been deceased since I was, like, three months. I never even got to see his face, showing what I could do, my talent. You know what I'm saying? But every time I go around, my daddy's side of him, they say I look just like my father. That's human-like him, everything, you know what I'm saying? But that's, like, kind of my, like, my only pain, like, you know what I'm saying? But... I got like responsibilities as well, like taking care of my little sisters. I got a niece now, my uncle, you know. And it just get harder and harder every day though, but you know, God gave me the responsibilities to make me stronger though. You know, and I just wanna be successful in my life. My biggest dream though to me is to take this bucket stuff like to another level, like what no one ever done. And I'm gonna get that to y'all. I wanna be a, become a philanthropist. Well, I am gonna become a philanthropist. You know, I'm gonna own my own building shape as a bucket where homeless people can sleep eat for free, you know, all that, and, like, some days, I would have days where you can come, like, sit down, you might have to, like, order something off the menu, you know, sometimes, you know, but basically, it's like a shelter, but, like, a recreational center, too, to keep the kids off the street, you know, even teach lessons, you know, that's a lot of stuff, man, but I'm, I'm gonna try my best to achieve that, though, and right now, I'm taking this online thing at college, I mean, um, my high school diploma, whatever, I'm gonna have my high school diploma by next month, and just go to college and just try to be successful in my life, you know. Take care of my list. I got two little sisters as well, you know. How old are your sisters? One of them 17. She got a baby. And um, the other one's 16. She she go to Paul. She, she, she at school right now. She go to Paul Rose. And my other um, sister at 17, she got a high school diploma online too. That's how I'm going to get mad. And 
pretty much the only thing I wanted to say, man, is God bless everybody. And you can do anything, you put him first, and just keep believing, you know, and treat your family right, your loved ones, because all this, it's replaceable, you know what I'm saying? All this replaceable, you know what I'm saying? But what ain't replaceable is, you know, the loved ones you have around you, and, you know, you know, just a lot of people, man, just once they gone, they gone, so just make, it's just make with do your best while you're here, you know, pray to God, try to do the right thing, you know. I thank God for blessing me with this talent right here, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> for real, though. Um, let my mom has to shine, I let you. Okay, good job. Okay, tell me your name and your age. My name is Sean Hunter, I'm 18 years old. I like, like, like my cousin here with that saying, it's hard out here. I ain't... That's what brought me up right here. That's what got me everything I wanted right here. I never had to ask my mom for nothing. When I was growing up, I got I got 15 brothers and sisters. Five on my mama's side, 10 on my daddy's side. I, ain't, I couldn't have anything I want. I always had to wait till they get something first. Then they said something. Then I gotta, then I gotta get something. I always had to wait. I got, I do my own stuff now. I ain't gotta wait for no handhold, nothing. Nothing at all. I do it my own self. That's why I'm so glad about myself. I'm proud about myself like that. Cause I ain't locked up in no jail. I ain't doing nothing. I've been through everything. Everything you can think of, I've been through. I'm still still fighting. I ain't going nowhere. It's just, I got a little, I got a little brother. I got a little sister. My little sister, 10 years old. I'm gonna take care of her to the, to the, to the man, to the fullest of me. To run out, I'm gonna take care of her. And no matter what, what happened. I had a, my, my family was decent though. It was all right. I had my two-parent house. I had the two-parent household until I was like 10. My daddy left on me. Well, he left on all of us, but it really wasn't nothing. My mama still, she a real, she a healthy woman. She raised six six boys, two girls by herself. She a healthy woman. I love that about her. I, I, ain't, I ain't gonna put no stress on her or nothing. Uh, it ain't like I don't want her to worry about me. It's just I want her to worry about the others that she have to worry about. She don't have to worry about me because I'm gonna take care of myself. It, it don't matter where that goes. I'm gonna take care of myself. It's just I love my I love my parents. I love I love I love my people, but I'm gonna take care of myself. If I if I need something, I will ask them. But it ain't like I'm gonna continue acting and send the house and no. Oh, I'd rather go pick up some sticks and go beat on my bucket like I always do. What's the hardest thing you've had to deal with? Police. Police? I can't I can't see how police don't let us beat on buckets. And people out here robbing, killing, murder, all everything else, but y'all be on us. So hard, like Tell them, tell them when they come they arrest like, you? Yeah. They take our money, arrest us, sticks, take our sticks, our take our sticks. buckets. Tell them how deep they be calling. They, they, they be calling like, people all, all type of names like we ain't nobody. Like we ain't, like, like, we ain't like, got I don't no mean, family or something. Like I don't mean nothing in this I world. God, I mean man. something in this world. And I'm going to let people know that before I leave off this world. I just, like to thank, I just like to thank everybody who I love. Everybody who appreciate me. Well, your your mom's two. did something right because you guys are good people. You got a good head on your shoulder. And, uh... I love just, What's your little sister's name? My little sister's name is Tarina Hunter. Tarina? It just, it's like, I got, like I said, I got five brothers. I kick with most of my friends more than I kick with my brother. That's, man, that's crazy. And I still love my brother. I love, I love. And ain't nothing gonna change about it. It just, it's just, they could go their own way and we can, and I can go my own way. They can have their own friends and I can have my own friends. And we come back and still come back to the bunch, we still gonna be together. Still could buy us together. And I ain't going nowhere. Ain't nobody going nowhere. That's why I love my homies right now. It ain't no homies like people that gang back rule. That's my, that's my, that's my gang member right here. These states in this bucket. Ain't nobody gonna change that. You got any, man. Just love my people. Thank you.